Good morning. All right, so let me introduce you to the Motley and Spider-Man. Mamadou Gusama is a migrant worker moving from place to place to find jobs, living in France after moving there from Mali just a couple months ago. So you know, he's enjoying himself, he's living in France, when all of a sudden, out of the window, he sees a crowd gathering around the place he's eating at. He goes outside to see what all the fuss is about and notices a child clinging to the side of a building. Not even thinking twice, Gusama runs up to the building and starts scaling the side of it like Spider-Man. And in no time flat, he gets to the child and rescues him. Meanwhile, you got these guys who Kasama is making look real pathetic right now. Now, you'd hope such a brave act would get some reward, and it did. Kasama met with the president of France, who gave him a medal of bravery, complete citizenship for France, and a free job position at the fire brigade. So next time you see someone in trouble or in need of help, just think, what would Spider-Man do? So apparently, West Lafayette, Indiana is a really nice place to be. And I don't mean live, I mean it's just nice. Like, it's, it's just nice. It's full of nice people doing nice things. And recently, the beer industry has taken off there. In the span of a year, the little town went from having two breweries to six. Well, all six of these breweries are quite successful. And the reason why is because none of them see the other as competition. Instead, they just help each other out. Yes, they respect each other and they think that everyone has their own niche. Specifically, this is the story of Jason Cook, a guy who started up his own brewery back in 2017 and was brewing over 216 gallons of beer. Well, after an accident that almost took his finger off, Jason had to be sent to the hospital, leaving all that beer just there by itself. And that's when two of the other breweries came in and completely saved the day. They finished making the beer, saving over 1,300 glasses of the stuff. It's a small story, but it's one I really like. All right, so final story of the day is just, is just too precious. So this little eight-year-old is named Maurice Adams Jr. And he's just driving with his mom in the car, you know how it is. When all of a sudden he sees an elderly woman trying to cross the street and get up some stairs. And he tells his mom, stop the car. Maurice runs out, goes up to the woman, and helps her get across the street and go up the stairs. He then comes back to his mom's car and they go along their merry way. His mom was very proud of him. Yep, and that will wrap up this week's episode of Swendoog. In the meantime, look out for those extra Swendoog posts that I give every Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday at 8pm. And I'll see you guys next week.